Uh, I caught my face on fire one time. Um, you know, when you learn how to do that, uh, the guy that taught me was Brian LaPalm down in Tampa, Florida. And um, he was working in one of those little parking lot carnivals, those small carny carnivals in the parking lot. And um, he was teaching me how to do it. And he said, you know, I got a mouthful of kerosene and you blow to the torch and you keep that. And the big fireball comes out with you. 80% of what you, uh, the kerosene is blown out. But you keep going. And the residue, okay? And you watch, and you actually watch it because it, it'll follow it down, the flame, the fire. So you get the big fireball and then you keep blowing because you always get the residue in it and it'll follow down, follow down. And he said, always a good fire breather will cut it off right before it reaches your lips, right? It, it stopped blowing. Well, I would get, I, I got, Excuse me, but I got a little ballsy and I was wanting to see how close I could get to my mouth, right? <laughs> and next thing, and all of a sudden, a kerosene was running down my chin and down my neck, you know? And next thing you know, I got flames burning through doing this on me. That wasn't a good moment for me. <laughs> <laughs> and then one time, uh, I was using a baton, uh, soaked in cotton in, uh, in kerosene, right? And wrapped wire around it. So that, that was my, my, my torch. And I remember I jumped, I, I just got finished, and I really had a big ball of fire, and I was, I was really happy, and I jumped off the top rope and into the ring, and I took that wand, and I went like this, and the end of it flew off, and it was on fire. <laughs> and it landed on this lady's shoulder, and I used one of those beehive-type hair. <laughs> and I'm like, she did that, that was this big, right? You can imagine the fire that thing created. Well, uh, uh, security got over there real quick and brushed it off the show. <laughs> <laughs> and, uh, but that was a scary moment. I mean, that, that could have been, whew, I would have been working the next 10 years for her. <laughs> <laughs>